With Cloud Shell Editor, you can easily run code from your web browser and deploy it to the cloud. In previous videos, we learned how to deploy Hello World applications to Cloud Run and Google Kubernetes Engine. But what if you want to extend your application to use other Google Cloud APIs? Cloud Shell Editor's Cloud Code integration makes it easy. Cloud Code is a set of IDE plugins that help you stay productive when developing cloud-native applications. In particular, Cloud Code has a Cloud API section that helps you easily browse available Google Cloud APIs, enable them, and add API client libraries to your project. From the Cloud Vision API, to the Cloud Storage API, to the BigQuery API, the possibilities are endless. Let's take a look at how to integrate the Google Cloud Translate API into a Python Flask web app. First, visit ide.cloud.google.com to launch Cloud Shell Editor. Select Terminal, New Terminal to open a new Cloud Shell terminal window. From here, run git clone to clone the sample code from GitHub. Then, we'll open the sample application as a new workspace with the Cloud Shell workspace command. You can see the list of files in the Explorer panel located on the left side of the screen. In the Cloud Shell terminal window, change directories to the location of the sample app. To run the sample app locally, run the following terminal commands. Press Command and click on the URL displayed to open your app. Congratulations! If you see this page, that means you successfully run the Hello World app locally using Cloud Shell Editor. Back in the Cloud Shell terminal window, press Control C to stop the local server. Now let's set up credentials so that we can authenticate Google Cloud API requests for local development. In the Cloud Shell terminal window, run gcloud config set project to set the Google Cloud project you want to use. Then run gcloud auth application default login. When prompted in the terminal if you want to continue, type in Y and press enter. Press command and click the link displayed in the terminal. This opens a new browser tab. Go ahead and authorize access to your account. Copy the authentication code displayed and paste it into your terminal. Now let's go ahead and integrate a new Cloud API into our application. First, click on the API icon on the left side of your screen. This opens the API Explorer, where you can browse the dozens of Google Cloud APIs for you to use. Select the Cloud Translation API, which allows you to translate between more than 100 languages. Under Enable API, click Enable API. Under Install Client Library, select Python. Let's copy the name of the translation library and paste it into our requirements.txt file, which lists out Python libraries we need for our app. Now we can configure our Python environment using virtual env and install dependencies using pip. Now that the client library is installed, let's translate some text. Open the web.py file to edit the Python code. First, add a line at the top to import the translation client library. Next, we're going to replace our existing root directory code with the following. This translates the Hello World text into Spanish. Finally, we'll run the updated application with Flask Run. Congratulations! If you see this page with the Spanish text, you successfully integrated the Cloud Translation API into your code. With just a couple of clicks, we were able to easily integrate a new Google Cloud API into our project. Want to try this out yourself? Check out the interactive tutorial linked in the description below or by launching it from the Cloud Shell Editor welcome page. Thanks for joining us for our Exploring Cloud Shell Editor video series. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more great videos.